welcome back to my channel. Today I'm going to be doing another day of Halloween and this is going to be all around Halloween inspired smells which I have um, accumulated over a very fast and very guilty um, sale that I <laughs> took full advantage of truly and as you guys know on my channel I do loads of Bath & Body Works hauls and when it comes to Halloween they kill it when it comes to scents of candles, hand sanitizers, decorations and oh I couldn't resist and I've also at the end of this video everything that I've mentioned here today I've added it all up so you guys can get an idea how much it is and how I get it over to the UK and what kind of price range you're looking at. I have to admit it is a pricey um, <laughs> pricey thing to do. I know on eBay they do amazing amazing deals and they make it very fair for people. I tend to because sometimes they can sell it so quickly on eBay I don't get to get the ones that I really really want to especially around Halloween so I'll go into that at the end but I'll get, first show you guys what I got and I have to say I went a little bit overboard. My mum wanted a couple of bits and bobs for um, at home as well, so it's not just me, luckily. <laughs> so I'll just get straight on into it. So the first thing we got is this little soap dispenser that's like a little pumpkin. Oh no, my goodness, this is so adorable. It's like proper copper um, colour, and actually, we're gonna pop this in our kitchen, and it's like really, really well made. The only thing I will say is, we found out it's more so for foaming soaps, more so we love to get the deep cleansing ones which I'll show you guys in a bit, but it tends to get stuck a bit more with those ones, whilst with foamy ones I feel like it would have no problem. So we got one of them. We also got a free wick holder, now this has got little silvery glittery pumpkins all around it and it's so so beautiful, it's like something so different to what you would get for a candle holder I feel and with it being pumpkin with having pumpkins on it it just makes it even more special and I'll do a close up of one of the candles in with it and oh my goodness this blew me away and these aren't as expensive as you think they would be actually I was really surprised and also really well made you can know you can keep this for so many years in the future it's just such a pretty little investment I feel. If you're one for decorating for Halloween, they have amazing decorative stuff. They even had magnets to put on your candles. I didn't get any of those because <laughs> I think if I, if I went for everything I wanted, I would have nothing in my bank left. <laughs> so, what shall we go with first? Shall we go with... Now, some of these one of these I have had before and I adored it, it was quite a few years ago and it was one of the first things I got from Bath & Body Works which I got from a website in the UK and it is called Twilight Woods now this is, if you're one of those people that like musky scents, this is the one for you it's absolutely beautiful their shower gels are really really moisturising, they're very strong scented and have vitamin E in so they really really help to nourish your skin and they really foam up lovely and I got a couple of those they got they had a range of within their bath range it was buy free get free free so of course I thought that advantage truly so we did get Twilight Woods which is apricot nectar mimosa and cypress wood sounds amazing doesn't it we then have dark kiss this one sounds really, really like Halloween I feel as well, and very like Sleeping Beauty. <laughs> Which has black, black raspberry, rose, bergamot incense, dark vanilla bean, and plum. So that is a whole combination of goodiness, and it smells really, really fruity that one if you're into your fruit scent. My mum is a huge fan of lavender, so I had to get a French lavender and honey because this sounded amazing for all year round. And look how beautiful the packaging is, it's like gorgeous. Now this one has French Lavender, Lily of the Valley and Nectarine, so it's very warm in this one. I feel this is an amazing one for if you were a person that loves to have your baths at night, I feel this is 
amazing for you because it's going to have that calming lavender to help you that sleepy mood. Oh god, these are new, I believe. I don't know if they've only just come out, but they are the moisturising body washes. Now, I don't know what the difference is between these and the normal ones because the normal ones are very moisturising in themselves. But I'm very intrigued to try these out. They also have pure honey in them, which really intrigues me as well. So I got the scent Pumpkin Latte, which is one of my most favourite Halloween scents from Bath & Body Works. It is just the cosiest, vanillarist scent that you would ever do see. Don't be put off by the latte part of it because it does not smell of coffee in the slightest. It smells like pure vanilla marshmallows melting on a fire. That's truly what it does. Now, it said pure honey, shea butter, cocoa is proven to moisturise after one shower. So these are really, really amazing for showers. Because sometimes you can wash away the product before you even use it. So it must be one of those that helps stay on, like those moussey formulations out there now. So it has key notes of, in this one. Pumpkin latte, toasted marshmallow, creamy sandalwood, white ginger, and praline musk. Absolutely the most amazing, cozy scent that you can have that F. And it's going to make you smell amazing. A filming of autumn blooms. Now, this one sounds like it would be a very fresh one. With marigold petals, sparkling bergamot, and cedar leaf, golden amber, and sandal. Oh, it's, it is. It's very floral, but then you have a little bit of musk in with that one as well. And I have to say, these feel really moisturising. They actually sink into your skin. They don't just sit on top. Well, I've just felt that. I can't wait to use these. Now, these were $14. $14. Well, the normal ones are $12.50. So, these are a little bit more expensive. But I wonder if it's because the ingredients are using them. So, at least you know you're getting different ingredients and they do different things it seems shall we go we'll go hand sanitizers next so this is such a cool concept so when you look at it it just looks like a huge like, pack of halloween sweets but they're actually hand sanitizers in them so you get three lots of one two three four five five different hand sanitizers so it's really good if you've got um a family that is just obsessed as I am and you like to share them all out this is a good value for money let me check how much this will come to $19.50 which I think is a really good value for how many you're getting so you're getting 15 antibacterials in there so that means you're only paying one pound and 30p for each so that is an extremely good value and I love like they're like a little bag of sweets I just find it and it's called girls night out how adorable is that so inside you get a Hey Girl Friend, a Vampire Blood, which I have had many a time as an amazing scent. I, they also had a candle in this, but it was all set out when I went to get it, which I'm really sad about. Three Perfect Pumpkins, three Spooktacular, and three Better Hand My Candy. So there is some oldies and goodies, and also newbies, which are very, very exciting, and I can't wait to get involved in all of that. Especially, especially around Halloween time because it's more chilly outside, more prone to get cold, which I've already got. <laughs> and you need to help stock up away from all those germs that are out and about. We then go to the really exciting part, which is candles. Vanilla pumpkin marshmallow three wick candle. This is the first ever candle that I got for Bath & Body Works last year. Fell in love with and adore. And I feel like I tried to mix it up a little bit with this year. I feel they've added a bit more cinnamon to it. So it has a little bit more spiciness. More so than sweetness. So if you were put off by this before, I think they've changed the, formula, the formulation a little bit. Of what's inside. And it has the most adorable casing on it. And... Honestly, I don't know what I'm going to put on for Halloween first because they all smell pretty incredible. It says on the back that it has a creamy vanilla fragrance with pumpkin spice, homemade marshmallow and drizzled, car drizzled caramel. Amazing. So that is our number one candle. Now this is the one I've heard many people talk about and it somehow slipped past my radar and I don't know why because it sounds like something I would adore. And that is pumpkin pecan waffles. Now I got the white barn one because it was a little bit cheaper than there was a beautiful more decorated one. But I thought a candle's a candle isn't it? 
and you might also pop it in one of these and it already makes it Halloween for you makes it more Halloween for you really doesn't it <laughs> so it's like the most amazing home goodness it smells like caramel popcorn like if you were to make it at home it would make your house smell like that for sure it says the fragrance has maple syrup, golden waffles, pumpkin spice and brown sugar and now this will not slip underneath my radar ever again it's just the most amazing combination of pumpkin and brown sugar if you can never distinguish that in a scent it's in this one so that is, this one is the piece of resistance and when I got it I did not realise how beautiful it was going to be and that is Spooky Sweets now this has the most beautiful detailing I've ever seen on a candle all the way around which I adore and then also has a glittery lid like how beautiful is this like truly it's gorgeous and this is similar promise to what the vampire blood one looked like that's another reason why I'm so gutted I didn't get it in time but I got one of them and I'm so happy for that so you have a little Dracula a little black cat and a little bat on the front and inside it smells a bit it has a mixture of fresh then warm tones like it has an element of apple scents, like really fresh apple then caramel mixed in it does say spooky sweets for the scent but to me it smells like proper caramel apples which is a huge thing which people have for Halloween and I couldn't understand why they've gone with that scent now it says on the back it has wickedly sweet caramel creamy cloves and dark sugar crystals which sounds flipping amazing and gorgeous like it's just the most beautiful thing that I've ever did see for Halloween and that might be taking pride and praise inside our pumpkin I did get another candle but it was for my auntie's birthday which was yesterday so um, and it was flannel which she ha I got for her last year for Christmas and she adored it and it's such a nice linen but cozy feel to it if that makes any sense but flannel is also an amazing one if you're looking for a cozy scent that is what really really lovely one to go for okay we're coming nearer to the last of it now okay we then have a pumpkin cupcake room spray now I thought these were going to be so much bigger than this was but I'm not complaining because I'm sure it's very very important let's have a spray shall we have a spray Oh yes, oh that smells lovely. So basically, I've never had one of these before, but I'm very intrigued by. They're seven dollars uh, fifty, and it's smelling really, really nice. It's not overpowering, and I read on the reviews that it lingers, which is what you need for a spray because sometimes you spray in the air, you smell it for one minute, and then it's gone. So that is awesome. Okay, our last thing, which you always know I get, is the deep cleansing soaps, um, which I got in a one, two, three, four, five, six, six pack. One of them is already downstairs, which I'll tell you which one that one is in a moment. And this was always, if you're going to get from the Bath and Body Works website, they have amazing bundles like this. And I feel like you save a little bit of money when you get them in a bundle. Another amazing reason why I always go to their website. Now inside we have Chris Morning Air. I've had a hand cream in that and that was absolutely beautiful. Afternoon apple picking, pumpkin cupcake, autumn citrus and sandalwood, and sweet cinnamon pumpkin. So all the autumnal fragrances all in one place and I'm so excited. I'm just so excited to use them. So that is all of the things that I got. As you can see I did get quite a lot and when I try and break this all down for you in terms of price range you might think it's worth it so let me just count how many products I did get in my mind so I got 19 products all together and on the Bath & Body Works website order that came to $174 but I was able to get 25% off because I always do amazing like 
promotions and sales so always wait for those because that means and they come very often I tend to get my autumnal scents like the first week of September because they do really good sales for it and always get the candles when they're half price too because it happens very very regularly and you get to have two for the price of one because they're ten dollars when they're half uh, when they're half price and twenty two when they're like full price. So it then so twenty five percent off was forty three dollars off, which is amazing. Then I had to pay five ninety nine for shipping to my locker at GoSend. Now, sometimes they also do a deal where you could get free shipping, but that was no worries. So it came to $136.87 in pounds. That is just fraction over 100. So it was 101.88p. Now, for all of these products, I find that really, really amazing because don't forget our pounds and dollars are totally different. So even though it might be more in dollars, it's a little less in pounds. If that makes sense. Now, for my Ghost and Locker, it took about, I would say, a week and a little bit for it to get to my Ghost and Locker. Now, within Ghost and, you can pay for whichever membership you like. There is a completely free one, which I use. But the only thing is, with the free one, you don't get to have a little bit of your shipping off. And also, you have to pay to see your photographs of everything. But I will say, I've never had a thing from there that's been broken. I know people say they've had it in the past, but previously... For me, I've not had any problems with them whatsoever. They're very prompt that once I've paid for the Ghost and Locker to come out, it, it takes a week to get here, which is crazy, from America. And the only other downside I feel to Ghost and is once your things go in your locker, you have seven days of free access to your locker. But if you are still saving money to bring it over to the UK, after your seven days you have to pay to keep them in your locker. I'm not sure how much that is because I tend to panic it and get them over as soon as possible. One of those is due to excitement. <laughs> so, for my ghost and locker to send it over to me, it was $145, which was 108 and 24p. Now it's just a little over how much I pay for the whole products. I know that sounds like quite a lot, really, really a lot, but for how quick it comes, it comes really well packaged, you are in constant contact of what's going down and you're knowing whereabouts it is. It travels quite a long way, I feel, to travel there and there, to be there in a week. If you do pay for a membership, yearly membership, you can get a little money knocked off, but I feel that's not too bad. For my customs, I got very, very lucky. It was £26. Now I find that extremely lucky because I've never had customs that low. But I find that is extremely helpful. And I did a little happy da dance, I'm not going to lie, when I saw how low that was. So in total, for getting the products, popping them in the locker, shipping them over to me, as well as customs, it came to £236.12p. and Now, I can see what a hell of a lot, but I tend to do mine seasonally, like mostly around Halloween and Christmas and summer is mostly what I do. So I don't think it's that bad considering how little I do it for and it's a treat and if you love Bath & Body Works, I don't find it as bad as it could be truly and I wanted to like pop all the prices down so you could get in your mind because I follow a most amazing group on Facebook called Bath and Bodies UK Lovers and they always were intrigued with how much I um, pay for and I really wanted to like put, break it down for you so hopefully that helped and I really really hope you guys enjoyed this video and if you have any of these products or any um, any other ones let me know below because I would love to know and if you love Bath and Body Works haul, please feel, feel free to subscribe because I do them quite often and they're quite big hauls so <laughs> feel free to if you want to so I hope you guys have a lovely lovely day and I'll see you guys in my next video bye